No, we are not in India. We're in Coral Gables, the city of Coral Gables, Florida. And as promised, I'm showing you the trees of Coral Gables. Tree-lined streets. You can compare to the Flagami neighborhood video that I recently posted. And you will find that the architecture, although some streets have nicer homes, others have nice homes, but similar to the Flagami neighborhood homes. The difference is in the trees and gardens. This is about, I would say, two miles away from where I shot the last video. What a difference, I feel. Basic home, beautiful trees, night and day. And the sun just came out, so. There we go, the canopy effect that I so much, that I love so much. There are your palms, somebody suggested we plant palms in Flagami. But I really don't care. Oh, what car is that? Tell me in the comments. <laughs> I don't really care what kinds of trees they have. Um, my friend Max reacted to the video before and he said that in the 60s and 70s, Flagami had trees everywhere. But he blames the Cuban for the, the Cubans uh, for the destruction of the, key, of the trees. Uh, the Cubans who moved in, um, as you know, I'm sure, the history of Miami. They started uh, arriving in 59 and the 60s after the Revolution. But um, he doesn't like that they destroy the trees and he's Cuban. Now, if you're in the Miami area and you want to know where you are, and you see one of these. This is Coral Gables Street Signs. So whenever you see that, you know you're in Coral Gables. To me, and I'll say it again, one of the most beautiful cities in the US with the best weather. It's February and I'm wearing short sleeves and I'm walking for an hour it's gonna be an hour walk to Flagami and an enjoyable one at that so I hope you're enjoying your days I hope you have trees <laughs> and I hope you have an RV like that one. My goodness, that's my dream right there. Little kitchenette. I would cook outside though, not inside. I used to have a Dodge Ram, um, similar, si similar in size with the high top and then we had the loft on top so I slept on top. And that was great with the kids. Took my four babies everywhere. Camping. We even went to Canada in that thing. From Chicago. Anyway. It's just a machine that helps you enjoy nature. Have a great day. <laughs>